Welcome back. This time we're talking about the series premiere of Powerless, the new NBC office comedy set in the world of the DC Comics. This first episode, entitled Wayne or Less, introduces us to our main characters and sets up the premise of the show, which is namely a group of people working for Wayne Security, a division of Wayne Enterprises run by Bruce Wayne's cousin, Van Wayne, played by Alan Tudyk. This episode is told from the point of view of Emily, played by Vanessa Hudgens, who is a new resident of Charm City. Moving from a literal flyover state where superheroes just flew over on their way to have battles elsewhere, to this big city where superhero battles happen all the time. And normal people like Emily get caught in the crossfire. And that's what Wayne Security is trying to do. Keep people safe from this collateral damage and make a buck along the way. And Emily is this new middle management boss brought in to oversee the R&D team, which includes Ron, played by Ron Futches, Teddy, played by Danny Pudi, and Wendy, played by Jenny Pearson. Her boss is Van. And the only other main character that we meet in this episode is Van's assistant, Jackie, played by Christina Kirk. Now, I know there's only so much you can do in a 24 minute pilot and this episode does sort of set up this whole concept of the collateral characters in a comic book. Um, there's actually a great opening sequence which shows classic comic book scenes and then focuses in on the scared citizenry in the background. Um, I, I, it's a great opening credit sequence. Especially since we really don't get many opening credit sequences for in most shows these days. My main issue with this first episode, which I did find funny and, and enjoyed, and I'm going to continue watching the show, is that aside from the specific uniqueness of setting it in the world of comic books, the office comedy part of this felt very office comedy. Um, you have your overly enthusiastic newcomer. You have the kind of wizened, beat-down old-timer. You have the ineffective boss. You have the mean office worker. You have the geeky office worker. You have the kind of happy-go-lucky office worker. Again, there's only so much you can do in a first episode, so I'm sure these characters are going to get fleshed out as time goes on. And nothing in this episode dissuades me from my opinions of the trailers, which were this is a show I want to watch. It takes over the time slot from The Good Place, which was one of my favorite new shows of this season. So for now, this is a show that I feel has a lot of potential, a lot of comedic potential. I haven't completely seen it fulfilled yet. And as I said, there's nothing specifically that I disliked about this show. I, I enjoy a lot of these actors. Um, I especially like the idea that Alan Tudyk being back on regular television. And I'm willing to stay the course and see what happens. So if you've seen this first episode, what did you think about it? As always, you can subscribe to my channel. Check out some of my other TV and movie reviews. And until next time, try not to write on dry eraser boards with permanent markers.